so very warm welcome to one and all present here today we are going to start new chapter known as quadrilateral what is a quadrilateral can you tell me anyone oh. good 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 a closed polygon that has four sides okay very good so quadrilateral is a four sided closed polygon ठीक है फोर साइडेड क्लोज पॉलीगन इज नोन एज कॉर्डिलेटर ठीक है क्लोज साइडेड फोर साइडेड क्लोज पॉलीगन ठीक है सी द फिगर ए बी सी डी हाउ मेनी साइड आर देयर इट हैज फोर साइड एंड इट इज अ क्लोज फिगर सो इट इज अ क्वारिलेटर ठीक है नाउ मूविंग ऑन फर्दर टूडे वॉट वी विल गोइंग टू सी और व्हाट विल गोइंग टू स्टडी ठीक है क्या क्या पढ़ने वाले हम लोग आज अबाउट क्वारिलेटरल्स क्वाड इज मेड अप क्वारिलेटरल इज मेड अप ऑफ टू वर्ड्स क्वाड एंड लेटरल व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ क्वाड क्वाड मींस फोर एंड लेटरल मींस साइड्स सो क्वारिलेटरल मींस अ फिगर अ थिंग दैट हैज फोर साइड्स क्लियर so quadrilateral is a closed figure bounded by four straight lines examples of quadrilateral this is a square rectangle rhombus trapezium or kite clear anybody is having any doubt okay good sure yes What happened, Chen Chen? Bolo. What is the name of the last figure? Kite, kite, kite. It is a kite. Yeah, you can say it is a rhombus, but it is mainly it is a kite only. Okay, this is a kite. Okay, this is a rhombus. Or you can say that. Pelogram or might be a rhombus. You can name anything. ठीक है. Rhombus बोल सकते हो. This can be a pelogram also. Okay. Anything. ठीक है. Okay. How to name a parallelogram? How to name? Clockwise. Clockwise A B C D. First one. Second one B C D A. Third one C D A B. And fourth one D A B C. Now anti-clockwise A D C B. D C B A. C B A D and B A D C. This is clockwise, and this is anti-clockwise. Clockwise means in the direction of clock, and this is clockwise. This is anti-clockwise. Clear? How to name the figure? Okay. Chal, good. What are adjacent sides? Adjacent side means which are nearby or joined by a common vertex. For example, AD and AB are the two adjacent sides having common vertex A. So first pair is AD and AB. Second one AB and BC having common vertex B. Third one. bc and cd having common vertex c fourth one ad and cd having common vertex d so this are known as adjacent sides or these are the pair of adjacent sides clear koi doubt hai anybody is having any doubt okay now opposite sides what are the opposite sides can you tell me what is the opposite of ab this are the okay ab and cd very good and this are the two opposites ad and bc okay these are the opposite sides clear now diagonals of a quadrilateral these are the diagonals one diagonal is bd and one diagonal is ac 
so ac and bd are the two diagonals yes or no okay good angles in a quadrilateral a quadrilateral has how many angles four angles angle a this is angle a this is angle b this is angle c and this is angle d these are the four angles in a quadrilateral okay four sides and having four angles how to name the angle this is angle a b c because b comes in the middle this is angle b a d a comes in the middle this is angle a d c and this is angle b c d clear a b c can be named as c b a a b c can be written as c b a b c d can be written as d c b c d a can be written as c d a and d a b can be written as b a d note everyone note this this is very important write down this in your copy everyone write down Okay. Written, completed. Now, what are <coughs> adjacent angles? BAD is adjacent to ABC. Adjacent means which are on the same side. Which are on the same side. This two are adjacent. This two are adjacent. Okay. This two are adjacent. This two are adjacent. Clear? Adjacent means which are on the same side. BAD is adjacent to ABC. BAD is adjacent to ADC. ADC is adjacent to BCD. BCD is adjacent to ABC. So adjacent means which are on the same line. Okay. Clear? Okay. Opposite angles. So, these two angles are opposite to each other. Angle ADC is opposite to angle ABC. Angle BAD is opposite to angle BCD. These are opposite angles. Opposite means amne samne wale. Chike? These are known as opposite angles of quadrilateral. Clear? Now, convex and concave quadrilateral. What is concave and convex quadrilateral? This is very important. Yes, tell me, Shin Chan. Deco, a convex quadrilateral. Okay. Okay, both, but both can have diagonals. Okay. Sunlo, what is the correct definition? Convex quadrilateral is a quadrilateral in which each angle is less than 180. This is the main definition. Each angle is less than 180. Deco, angle A, 
less than 180 angle b less than 180 angle c less than 180 angle d less than 180 so convex quadrilateral is such type of quadrilateral in which every angle is less than 180 now talking about concave a quadrilateral is said to be concave quadrilateral if at least one angle is a reflex angle or larger than 180 so what is the condition at least one angle must be greater than 180 so see angle f is greater than 180 so if in a quadrilateral any one of the angle is greater than 180 so it is a concave quadrilateral yadi koi quadrilateral mein ek bhi angle 180 se zyada ho gaya so it will be a concave quadrilateral clear so here angle f is greater than 180 therefore efgh is a concave quadrilateral clear so what is the definition of concave and convex clear to all chal okay good now are you ready for the quiz current start quiz okay so before starting the quiz just write down the definition of concave and convex because this is very important just write down fast write down the definition of concave and convex quadrilateral with proper diagram written beta completed okay so now quest number 1 question number 1 is the answer is correct what is question number 1 when four points are drawn on a plane and no three of four are collinear it means the close figure obtained by joining the four points having four sides is known as quadrilateral beta mute your mic dekho when four points are drawn on the plane for example these are the four points 1 2 3 and 4 and no three out of four are collinear none of them is collinear collinear means which are on the same line so the figure formed by joining all the points is known as quadrilateral clear so what is the answer of question number 1 quadrilateral theek hai write down write down the question write in your copy fast manti कौन गया अगर पीछे उसको बोलना ऐसा ऐसा मत घुमा कर चड्डी बयान में
चलो रिटर्न कंप्लीटेड सिंचन कंप्लीटेड ओके गुड नाउ क्वेश्चन नंबर टू अ कॉर्डिलेटरल हैज अ कॉर्डिलेटरल हैज फोर साइड्स एंड फोर वर्टाइसेस फोर वर्टाइसेस मींस दिस आर द वर्टाइसेस दिस आर द वर्टाइसेस ओके so write down this question also a quadrilateral has four sides and four vertices clear where where abcd are the vertices and ab bc cd and da are the four sides note down this question in your copy okay a quadrilateral has four sides and four vertices have you written the solution this one this two points Okay, wait for this. Kunal, written, completed. Okay. चलो नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन हाउ मेनी डायगोनल्स अ कॉन्वेक्स कॉर्डिलेटरल हैव अ कॉन्वेक्स कॉर्डिलेटरल हैज टू डायगोनल्स दिस आर द टू दिस इज डायगोनल ओके डायगोनल नंबर 1 एंड डायगोनल नंबर 2 सो व्हिच अदर नेम ऑफ द डायगोनल्स ए सी एंड बी डी आर द टू डायगोनल्स ए सी एंड बी डी आर द टू डायगोनल्स ठीक है सो कॉर्डिलेटरल हैज हाउ मेनी डायगोनल्स टू चलो लिखो ये वाला क्वेश्चन राइट डाउन दिस क्वेश्चन इन योर कॉपी विद डायग्राम Okay, good, beta. How was your exam? Fine. Okay. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. What is the question? Yes. Yeah. Completed. How many diagonals a convex quadrilateral have? Two diagonals. Clear? Chalo. Next one. Which of the following polygon is not convex? This is a convex polygon. Because the one of the angle is greater than one eighty, yes or no? Because this angle is greater than one eighty. Anybody is having any doubt in this figure? Okay, the given angle is not convex. It is a concave polygon. Clear? This is concave polygon because one angle is greater than one eighty degree. ठीक है दिस वेरी सिंपल बेटर नाइनटी डी नहीं होता है क्या होता है वन एंगल मस्ट बी ग्रेटर देन वन एट्टी ठीक है ये वाला एंगल देखो वन एट्टी से ज्यादा है ठीक है चलो आइडेंटिफाई द वर्ड व्हाट इज द वर्ड Identify the word. क्या आएगा बताओ Identify the word. Can you name the spelling? Laughter. Laughter. ठीक है Laughter is the word. चलो The sum of One more important thing. 
द सम ऑफ इंटीरियर एंगल्स ऑफ अ ट्राइंगल इज वन एटी डिग्री देखो दिस वन दिस वन एंड दिस वन इज वन एटी दिस वन दिस वन दिस वन इज वन एटी तो टोटल एंगल सम ऑफ कॉर्डिलेटरल विल बी थ्री सिक्सटी सो फ्रॉम हियर इट कम्स द एंगल सम ऑफ कॉर्डिलेटरल इज थ्री सिक्सटी राइट डाउन दिस इन योर कॉपी the sum of all the interior angles of a quadrilateral is 360 degree note down this in your copy this sum of all the angles of a quadrilateral which are inside the quadrilateral okay all the interior angles sum is 360 degree so angle a plus angle b plus angle c plus angle d is 360 degree okay write down this also with diagram diagram bana liya tumne show everyone just show your copy batao kal if you are writing just show your copy na you have drawn the yeah you have to draw the diagram Yeah. करो बेटा ओके कंप्लीटेड गुड फाइंड द मेजर ऑफ द अननोन एंगल इन द कॉर्डिलेटरल दिस इज योर क्विज क्वेश्चन ट्राई टू फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ एंगल आर take your time yeah tell me the answer of angle r what is the value of angle r एक मिनट एक दो तीन चार पांच छ सात आठ इधर आ रहा है एक दो तीन चार पांच छ सात आठ नौ इसके अंदर एक दो तीन चार पांच छ ओके चलो एवरीबॉडी ऑन द स्क्रीन वी नो दैट द सम ऑफ ऑल एंगल्स ऑफ अ कॉर्डिलेटरल इज 360 डिग्री सो एंगल टी प्लस एंगल एस प्लस एंगल आर प्लस एंगल क्यू इज इक्वल्स टू 360 डिग्री एंगल टी इज 69 एंगल एस इज 65 एंगल आर वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट एंगल क्यू इज 98 इक्वल्स टू 360 डिग्री 
What is the sum of 69 plus 65 plus 98? Can anyone tell me? Batao. What is the sum? Tell me, bhai. Fata fata batao. 69 plus 65 plus 98 is 232 equals to 360 degree. Angle R is 360 minus 232. So angle R is 128. Clear? The value of angle R is 128. Anybody is having... Again, I'm telling angle T plus angle S plus angle R plus angle Q is equal to 360 degree. Angle T is 69. Angle S is 65. Angle R we have to find out. Angle Q is 98 is equal to 360. So what is the sum of 69 plus 65 plus 98? 232 equals to 360 degree. Angle R is 360 minus 232 which is 128. The value of angle R is 128 degree. Clear to all? Koi doubt hai? Anybody is having any doubt? Okay, chalo. Find the value of x. Start solving this question. Find the value of x. Take your time and tell me the answer. So, what is the value of x? Batao, tell me fast. Sinchen. Beta, what is the value of x? Okay, chalo, let us check. We know that the sum of all angles of a quadrilateral is how much? 360. So 97 plus 131 plus 15 plus 4x plus 57 equals to 360 degree. What is the sum of 97, 131, 15 and 57? The sum is 300. 4x is equal to 360 degree. 4x equals to 360 minus 300. 4x equals to 60 degree. The value of x is 15. Okay, good. Anybody is having any doubt? Okay, good. Chalo. Moving on to the next one. Find the value of angle B and angle C. Fast. Take your time and tell me the answer. Find the value of angle B as well as angle C.
completed. Okay, 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 take your time. चलो आई एम डूइंग ठीक है धीरे धीरे कर रहा हूं जस्ट एवरीबडी ऑन द स्क्रीन सम ऑफ ऑल एंगल्स ऑफ कॉर्डिलेटर इज 360 70 प्लस 11x प्लस 16 प्लस 11x प्लस 7 प्लस 80 इज इक्वल टू 360 हाउ मच x वी आर हैविंग 11x प्लस 11x 22x Now the sum of seventy plus sixteen plus seven plus eighty. Seventeen. Matlab what is the sum? Seventy plus sixteen plus seven plus eighty. One. Kitna hoga? One seventy three. Yes. Good. One seventy three. So one seventy three equals to three sixty. Now twenty two x equals to. 360 minus 173. So what is the answer? 22x equals to how much? 360 minus 173, 187. Yes, 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 yes. 187 upon 22. What is the answer? The value of x is 8.5. Yes or no? 187. Okay, okay. Eight point five. The value of x is eight point five. Now the value of angle B. Angle B is eleven into eight point five plus seven, and the value of angle C is eleven into eight point five plus sixteen. So eleven into eight point five. What is eleven into eight point five plus seven? Hundred point five. And eleven into eight point five plus sixteen is one zero nine point five. So answer of angle B is hundred point five, and answer of angle C is one zero nine point five. Okay, just you have to do the calculation part. Clear? Anybody is having any doubt? Okay, chalo. Moving on to the next one. ठीक है angle B and angle C. Hundred point five, one zero nine point five. The four angles of a quadrilateral are three ratio, five ratio, seven ratio, nine. Find the angles. How you have to do? Ata hai? Are you aware how to solve this? Nine. Very good. Very good. Let the angles are in the ratio of x. So three x plus five x plus seven x. Plus nine x equals to three sixty. How much x are there? Sum. Tell me the sum. Seven plus three ten. Nine plus five fourteen. So twenty four x equals to three sixty. So the value of x is three sixty by twenty four. It will going to come fifteen. So first one three x three into fifteen. Fifteen three the forty five. This first angle. Second angle five x five into fifteen fifteen five is a seventy five seven from this seven x seven into fifteen fifteen seven is a one hundred and five nine x nine into fifteen that is one thirty five so these are the angles note this in your copy everyone. Anybody is having any doubt? Clear to each and every one. Okay, good. Okay.
So these are the angles 45, 75, 105 and 135. Now question number 2. Deco. You have to find out this unknown angle. You have to find out this unknown angle. So angle Q plus angle R plus angle S plus angle T is 360 degree. 100 plus angle R plus 70 plus 665 is 360 degree. 235 plus angle R is 360. Therefore, the value of angle R is 125. This is very simple. We have done this type of question earlier also. Anybody is having any doubt in this? Just write down the question in your copy for your reference purpose. Write down this question in your copy. Okay. With all the given values. Okay, good. Moving on to the next one. You have to find the measure of angle B and angle C. This type of question we have done earlier also. Angle B and angle C we have to find out. So, I am writing over here. 90 plus 40 plus 12x plus 7 plus 12x plus 5 equals to 360 degree. How many x are there? 12x plus 12x? 24x. Okay. Let me get the gate. Let me get the gate. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Wait a minute. My screen is visible. Okay. Look. How much x? 90 plus 40 plus 7 plus 5. How much x? 142 equals to 360. 24x equals to 360 minus 142. 24x equals to 360 minus 142, 218. Therefore, the value of x is 218 upon 24, that is 9.1. Clear? So, angle B will be 12 into 9.1 plus 5, that is 114.2. 12 into 9.1 plus 7, that is 116.2. Clear? Anybody is having any doubt in this beta? Good doubt hai? Okay, chalo, good. Same question that we have solved earlier. Four angles are in the ratio 5, ratio 2, ratio 6, ratio 2. So, let the sum is 5x plus 6x plus 2x plus 2x is equal to 360. How many x are there? 15 x equals to 360 degree. The value of x is 360 by 15 that is 24. So first angle is 5 x. So 5 into 24, 120. Second is 2 x, 2 into 24, 48. Third one, 6 into 24, 144. Fourth one, 2 into x that is 2 into 24, 48. These are the angles. Clear? Anybody is having any doubt? Shenchen clear a bit? Okay, okay, good. Chalo. So what we have studied today? Angles of quadrilateral, adjacent angles, opposite sides, angle sum property and the sum of all angles of a quadrilateral is 360 degree. How many angles of quadrilateral are there? Four angles A, B, C, D. Clear? 
adjacent angles which are on the same side angle a is adjacent to angle b as well as angle d angle b is adjacent to angle a as well as angle c yes or no third one angle c is adjacent to angle b as well as angle d and the fourth one angle d is adjacent to angle a as well as angle c so adjacent angles we have completed opposite sides ab and cd are opposite to each other ad and bc are opposite to each other what is the angle sum property the sum of all angles angle a plus angle b plus angle c plus angle d is 360 degree clear koi doubt hai okay anybody is having any doubt okay okay i am just telling just write down this in your copy theek hai wait a minute Have you written this one? Angles in a quadrilateral. Okay. Okay. Just quick revision. These are the angles: angle A, angle B, angle C, angle D. Adjacent angles are given. These are the adjacent angle pairs. ठीक है? And which are the angles? Four angles are there: angle A, angle B, angle C, angle D. Diagonals AC and BD are the diagonals. opposite sides ab and cd are the pair of opposite sides how many sides are there four sides are there okay these are the four sides adjacent side means having a common vertex so this are the pair of adjacent sides okay and this is known as naming of quadrilateral so we have done a quick recap of what we have studied today so anybody is having any doubt sinchan beta okay what about you chalo so thank you so much to each and everyone for attending today's session okay see you in the next class yeah okay beta yeah bye 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 thank you so much